A very good evening to everyone. I'm Sachi Gupta from Grade 8. We are here for debate and we will be speaking on the behalf of online classes. We are a team of five members. These are my teammates Samriti, Ishika, Tanisha and Sneha. Thank you. Good morning everyone. I am Samriti from Grade 8 and these are my team members. We are a group of five members and we are here to represent ourselves on behalf of offline Hello everyone, I'm Anushka. Hello everyone, I'm Nupur. Hello everyone, I'm Good morning everyone, I am Nanda. Online classes have been popular during the pandemic moreover. It was used in foreign countries but it's been very popular nowadays after the pandemic. Many people are shifting their classes and works from offline to offline. So this definitely shows that online classes are very efficient. Online classes does not instill confidence in the child. It's not like that because the teacher can uh, the teacher can interact with the students very much and it can build confidence. Okay, Sachi, and what about the extracurricular activities which doesn't happen in online classes? I mean, in offline classes, we do biological activities, lab, uh, which contributes our mental and physical development. Okay, I understand, but I would like to ask you one thing. Like, in our education system, still, the government uh, gives priority to the theory more than practical. And if we are concerned about the practice, that it can also happen in online classes and they can well understand in online classes because there are too much gathering in offline classes and only some, some students who are curious can understand. Okay sir, that's a point. But what about the internet? Can you please repeat your point? Saji, I got your point, but uh, now days the internet are very costly in uh, online classes. Uh, no, Anushka, I don't agree with your answer. Um, online classes is more uh, expensive. I understand offline class is very expensive, is transport charge, maintenance charge is also added, but offline, but online class is not added, maintaining charge of traveling charge. But it is not mentally drawn. How can you say that it, it stops mental growth? Because even if we are uh, like doing online classes, after the online classes, we get so much time, we can do our hobbies, we can understand our culture, and we can also do some home science, which are a livelihood for living. We can know about our culture, about the science behind our festivals. And it's very important for the new generation. Okay. Okay, and what about the seriousness? I mean, uh, in online classes, some students are less likely to serious and committed to their study. In fact, the teacher doesn't know what the student behind, uh, what the student doing behind the camera. They also get distracted by social media. I don't agree with your point, Rupal, because like in online classes, that uh, students cannot get distracted. Like there are so many like programs like Baiju, Vatan Junior, and PW, and in that there are provisions that the uh, students cannot open social media programs while during the class. And if you are saying that they are not attentive in class, you can uh, observe that in all, uh, offline classes also, 90% of the uh, uh, class are talking and not attentive in the class. But in offline classes, there is a teacher who keeps an hawk eye on each student and the monitor who took all the responsibility. So, I don't agree with your point. Uh, I agree with your point, but 
online teacher also online class also a teacher that is we can take all the students and same thing same thing but the teacher doesn't know what the student doing behind the camera even in offline classes there are so many students and in the online classes it's not like that like all uh, the uh, uh, teacher says to like all the cameras that if they are not attending they can uh, tell the uh, parent tell the videos should be recorded and um, and while on uh, offline class videos should not be recorded Samriti, can you repeat this your point? Yes, four to five. In online class, video should be recorded. Uh, while in offline class, video should be not recorded. Yes, four to five. Online classes get network issue too. Uh, online classes so uh, cheap you can buy. Every poor poor people that does not. Every uh, nine people out of ten people have internet connection. So how you can say that? Many like even the poorest one have the phones and uh, like the normal smartphones and they have the internet connection. So it's not a big problem in nowadays. Okay, Sachin, I agree with your point. But what about the noise that meets uh, in online classes? Well, this should be a disadvantage for offline classes, I would say, because the noise can be made in offline classes more. The back benches and all the middle benches make noises, but in online classes, if they want to like talk, they can use you only use the chats. So there should be there is no noise in online classes, and there is noise in offline classes only. So this is the disadvantage for yourself. The um, their students' voice are not uh, reachable to the teachers due to some network errors, or maybe their voice get echo. We can chat and uh, message to the teacher. That can be uh, that can be placed and a uh, message to your uh, study. In online class, you can easily communicate with your professor. Okay. Okay, but in online classes, we are not connected with the outer world. Uh, means uh, our friends in a natural way. So in online classes, the first priority is about your friends. I don't think that. I think the opposition team is misleading the conversation. Actually, I don't agree with your point. I don't understand what he wants to say. Okay. Okay. So you are telling that the students go to the offline school just to talk with their friends, and if it is about like to be like friendly with their friends, there are so many social media calls, video calls they can talk whenever they want. So if you are telling that they can't connect with their friends, you are telling me that the first priority is their friends, not the study. How can you not agree with your point? Just give me some new reasons, and I will be uh, convinced. Well, by doing online class, it does not create uh, self confidence in the student to interact with other people. No, I don't think so. Because in offline classes, there are so many students. Only the toppers that are very confident about their knowledge just raise, raise their hands and like talk, and they just give the answer. And rest of them are just sitting. This uh, the teacher don't even like notice them. <laughs> Oh. Yeah.
Nice. Your time is over, and uh, you guys have done very well. Now, we have just observed and we have just uh, listened to our all participants how well they performed their parts. Now you can uh, take your seats.